Hi there, my name is Werner Swart and I'm the pastor of United Community Church here in Buenos Aires. And today I'd like to briefly share with you about how governance at UCC works. UCC was incorporated as a faith-based NGO in Argentina in 1969. Since the Argentine constitution does not allow for any other body than the Roman Catholic Church to be fully recognized as church by the state. This means that as with all faith-based NGOs, we are a self-governing body. And in order to make sure we function in accordance with the laws of the land, the congregation chooses board members from among themselves to act as their representatives. This is done every year at our annual general meeting, or AGM. At our AGM, each member of UCC of 18 and above can vote to choose four new board members. This means that the entire board could potentially be renewed every three years. I say potentially since board members may be re-elected for multiple terms. Each year, the board and congregation also chooses the board officers, meaning the chairman, treasurer and secretary, each with their respective deputies. At our AGM, we also choose new chairs or leaders for our different ministry teams, and we approve our annual financial statements, having been checked and approved by our two internal auditors. While UCC governs itself through the board overseeing all aspects of the church, according to the UCC constitution, the pastor is given a clear mandate to lead the implementation of all activities of the church from the worship service to the daily administration of resources within clear parameters outlined by the board. It is for that reason that the pastor is also a member of any and all committees and ministries while he or she also participates as a full voting member of the board. The pastor therefore serves as both the spiritual leader and administrative officer. In 2020, as pastor of UCC, I began to also convene a ministry team that would function as a spiritual leadership team together with me and my wife. This ministry team has no official authority, but together assists me and my wife in leading the congregation spiritually. As was said in one of the other videos, UCC is an independent body, and this means that all activities get funded and staffed from within. And so there's no invisible patron or denomination somewhere that funds us. We are responsible for annually drawing up, approving and executing a clear budget to do what God has called us to do, while trusting God to provide everything we need from within our present and past members. If you would like to know more about how to give to UCC's vision and mission, consult our website. And if you need any more details about any aspect of our governance, or maybe even a copy of our constitutional statutes, please do not hesitate to contact our church office. God bless you.